to come in uh, from Instagram, from Facebook, from YouTube. And so uh, let's just take a minute, allow our friends to come in from around the world. I'm Mel Robbins. I host the Mel Robbins podcast. And I want to talk today about this sentiment that I am seeing in the inbox, in the DMs, in the comments. So many of you are struggling with finding a sense of purpose. You're struggling with a major change that has been forced upon you and it's kind of knocked you on your heels and you're wondering, how do I get my power back, Mel? And so as you are joining this live stream, I want to welcome you. Why don't you hop into the comments and let me know where you're tuning in from because I want to give everybody a chance to come in. I even have notes. What the heck did I do? Oh, here it is. I've got notes that we're going to talk about. And the big theme that I want to talk about is this. I see so many of you that are writing in from around the world and something has happened in your life. Maybe you lost a job. This happened to somebody in my family who I love. Uh, his job has been fantastic. He's worked for the same firm for 10 years. In fact, he was having the best three months of his professional life and he was on this huge project and all of a sudden out of nowhere, he gets laid off. Huge change forced upon him. Maybe you've gone through a breakup or a divorce and somewhere in the back of your mind, you know that it is probably a good thing, but you didn't really want it. And so now you are faced with the task of having to reinvent yourself. Maybe you're at a point where my husband and I are at, where our kids are all flying the nest as they are supposed to do by this fall when our son goes off to college. Uh, we will be empty nesters which can be a big moment of change. And it's something that happens. It can be a great opportunity. It can also make you feel really paralyzed. Maybe you're graduating from graduate school or college this spring and you don't have a job yet. And as you watch everybody else move to different cities or move on with their life, or they know exactly what they wanna be doing with their life, it's daunting to you because you haven't figured it out yet. And so today I'm gonna to talk about what do you do when you're at this crossroads in your life? There's a big change that you'd like to make happen, but you feel a little frozen or you feel a little uncertain. And the fact is no one is coming. No one is going to come and figure this out for you. It's up to you. It has always been up to you. And I'm going to tell you something. You have everything within you to figure this out. You have everything already inside you to meet this moment, whether it's a moment of change, a moment of opportunity, and to find clarity and a sense of purpose to help drive your life forward. And when I think about my life, I have been at this crossroad so many times. It, it's just stunning. And the bottom line is you have to accept the fact that wherever it is that you are in your life at this moment, that no one is going to come and do the work for you. And the reason is simple. Your life is your responsibility. Your happiness is your responsibility. Your success is your responsibility. And that's a good thing because it means it's well within your control and it's in your hands. And so what I want you to first accept is that no one's coming. Second thing I want to ask you is what is the big change that you're facing right now? Have you lost a job? Are you going through a breakup? Do you feel just like this sense of blah and fatigue with your day-to-day -day life and you wish things would change, but it's just not changing? I want you to write in the comments, what is a change that you wanna see happen in your life? And I'm gonna talk a little bit about periods in my life where I have been really stuck or I have had the situation where things around my life were changing and I didn't like it but I didn't know what to do about it, okay? And this goes all the way back to, somebody asked me last night, how did you get into writing books and doing a podcast and doing all the things that you do, Mel? And the fact is that I didn't choose to get into this business originally. What happened, if you don't know the story, is that my entire life went off the rails. My husband had gone into the restaurant business. It was really great until it wasn't great at all. We lost our entire life savings. I lost my job. And as I was swirling in self-doubt, as I was feeling paralyzed, and as I was so angry about what had happened and I felt so bad for myself, I realized if I wanted to keep the house, I had to do something about this mess. If I wanted to get out of a financial crisis, nobody was gonna come and fix this for me. 
I, I needed to stop being mad at my husband for not being able to fix it. I needed to take responsibility for what I wanted to create in my life. And that's what I want to grab you by the shoulders today and awaken in you. See, there is this power and this confidence and this ambition that is dormant inside you right now. And we got to awaken that up because there is a change that you want to make. And you've been kind of sitting around either waiting for permission or waiting for the right time or waiting for somebody to come along and tell you, okay, let's do it now or waiting for somebody to provide all the answers. It's not happening. It's not happening because that's not how life works. At some point, you got to awaken that power and awaken that frustration and awaken that ambition inside you and go, you know what? There's a change that I want to make in my life, and I am going to take responsibility for making that change happen. If I want a different job, it's my responsibility to go do it because nobody's going to come and give me that job. If I want a different relationship and I want my marriage to be better, it's my responsibility to do the work to make it better because no one's going to come and change it. For you. If I want a better relationship with myself, I want to feel loved. I want to feel valued. I want to respect myself. I got to stop waiting around for somebody else to make me feel better about myself. And I got to do the work to take responsibility for my life. And there will be so many moments in your life where you come to one of these crossroads where you're like, okay, I could keep going the way that I'm going. I know how this turns out because I've been doing the same thing I've been doing for a very long time. So I can look ahead and I can predict a year from now, five years from now, 10 years from now, heck, I know exactly what my life is going to look like because I'm going to keep doing the same thing. Or you have this wake up call and you go, holy cow, all this stuff in my heart, all this ambition, all this power, all this confidence, all these dreams, it's real. I don't need anybody's permission. I need to wake up and give myself permission. I need to start getting serious and taking responsibility for doing the work to create the kind of life that I want for the, create the results that I want, because no one is coming to do it for you. And so if you've been sitting around, like I used to sit around feeling frustrated, feeling stuck, kind of addicted to talking about my problems, this is your wake up call. No one's coming to fix this. Absolutely no one. And so you can make a decision today that you're going to be the one that makes this change happen. And I want you to put in the comments right now, what is the change that you want to make happen? And I'm going to give you some examples from my life. So when I was 41, 14 years ago, $800,000 in debt, unemployed, three kids under the age of 10. Boy, did I wish somebody was going to come in and pay off my bills, but no one's coming. Boy, did I wish that there were not liens on my house but no one's coming to get them off the, the house. Boy, did I wish that I had a high paying job. No one was coming to give it to me. I had to make a decision that I was gonna wake up and take responsibility for where my life was right now and what I was gonna do about it. That's how you change. You have this awakening where you realize that you've been waiting for the right time. You've been waiting to feel ready. You've been waiting for somebody else to inspire you to do it. You've been waiting for permission. You've been waiting for someone else to help make it easier. Mm, that is a losing formula. And you want to know why I know it's a losing formula because I followed it for way too long in my life. You need a wake up call. You need to take accountability for what you want to create in your life. And then you got to prove it to yourself through the actions that you take starting today to make what you want a reality because no one's going to come and do it for you. And yeah, your friend Mel Robbins is in your life because I believe in you. See, I see a much bigger possibility for your life than you see for yourself. I see something different for you. I see you being able to be happier. I see you having the best friends of your life in the future. You haven't even met them yet. I see so much creative expression for you. I see the ability for you to pay off your debt and experience the freedom of, of being in control of your money. And I can say that because I used to be a person who was nearly a million dollars in debt. I used to be a person that could not put groceries on the table. I used to be a person that was a victim and that felt like, uh, you know, life was unfair. And yeah, life is unfair. Okay. And what are you going to do about it? What are you going to do about it? There are people out there who are so much dumber than you that have all the things that you want. Why? Because they woke up and realized nobody's going to do this for me. And if you can Google it, you can figure out a roadmap to something. And if you're willing to get up every day and chip away at it, you can shock yourself with the results that you can create. And so 
I am here to tell you everything that you have seen me achieve, whether it is the millions of books sold or more than 12 million people that follow me online or one of the top 10 podcasts in the entire world that I just launched 18 months ago. Nobody did that for me. Yeah, I have a team. Yes, I uh, seek out help and I seek out advice and I follow people that are in the space in order to study the space that I'm in. These are some of the tricks. I turn myself into a student, but nobody was coming to make it happen. Like at some point you got to wake up and go, wait a minute, I could be happier. I could make a lot more money. Why am I sitting around working for Steve when I don't even like Steve? There's 8.3 million jobs that are listed today because I looked in the United States, 8.3 million jobs. Your job is not the only job on the planet. Your boss that you're griping about is not the only boss on the planet. And no one is coming to promote you. No one is coming to do this for you. It's up to you. You want a better career? Prove it. Go make it happen. If you want to be healthier, prove it. Make it happen. If you want to uh, recreate your life and move across country, prove it. Make it happen. All this talk, all this thinking, it is so cheap. And I get so passionate about this because I wasted decades of my life sitting around feeling sorry for myself. That ends today. You got to wake up. And these things that you really want in your heart to change, you are so smart. Could you give yourself more credit? You are so capable. Isn't it time to give yourself more credit? And you want to know how you give yourself the biggest amount of credit? You freaking wake up and start working for it. You don't wait for permission. You don't wait for lightning to strike. You basically go, okay, that's it. If Mel Robbins can do it, I can do it. And this is particularly true. If you've just lost a job or you've gone through a divorce or you're at a moment where you need to reinvent yourself, what are you doing sitting around waiting for somebody else to come in and fix this? Are you kidding me? You're so much cooler than that. This is why I show up twice a week at the Mel Robbins podcast. And I am here to empower you and inspire you to think differently because I see something different for you. I used to live in a headspace where I was full of anxiety. I used to be full of jealousy and self-doubt. I used to be a kind of person that was constantly in her own way. And you don't have to live like that but you got to make a decision about what you want to make happen in your life and put it in the comments. What do you want to make happen? You know, some of the, some examples of what you could make happen. You could write a book. You could change your job. You could go back to school. You could finally declutter your house and have the energy of your house align with the big projects and clarity that you have in your mind. You could get serious about fun and friendship and make it a, a goal of yours that this is the year that you are going to do the work to create the best friend group that you have ever had in your entire life, because why the heck not? Or this is the year that you're going to truly stop giving your time and energy to everybody else. You're going to stop all the people pleasing. You're going to stop all the shrinking and thinking and procrastinating. And you are going to make it your mission this year to get healthy, to feel better, you alive, to get your energy back. You are so capable of this. And I see what all y'all are doing. You're writing all this. You're like, I am going to write a book. I am going to start that YouTube channel. I am going to finally get serious about the side business in real estate or the selling of the, the skincare products that I launched three years ago. And I keep avoiding all of the income producing activities. Yeah, I say I'm all busy. I'm too busy for that. But you're too busy for your own life. You're too busy to do the small things every day that advance what you actually want. You know, I'm going to invite you to do something today. I'm going to invite you to find the courage to step into your life. I'm going to say that again. I'm going to invite you to find the courage to step into your life, to see yourself at a fork in the road and one lane is a lane you've been traveling down, which is thinking about it, procrastinating, feeling far, sorry for yourself, feeling like a victim, looking at everybody that has the things that you want, telling yourself some dumb lie that you can't possibly do the work to get what you want. It's a complete lie that you're telling yourself. Maybe you're scared. Maybe you're overwhelmed. That's normal. And what are you going to do about it? Are you going to keep going down this road or are you ready to make a change? 
Are you ready to show up differently for yourself? Are you ready to get serious about what you want instead of letting another year go by? And I get so riled up about this because I wasted so much of my life thinking about what I wanted and feeling jealous of people that had it and feeling small. And when you make a decision that you're not going to sit around anymore and watch what everybody else is doing, but you're going to turn inward and you're going to start creating happiness and habits. And you're going to start focusing just a small amount of time every day, working on something that matters for you. That's what it takes. That's it. You want to think it's some big thing. It's not, it's actually the smallest thing that unlocks all your potential. And the smallest thing that you need to do is you got to be like, okay, this is what I want to change about my life. And today is the day. Today's day one. It's not one day. I'm not going to do this for another year. I'm not going to waste another five years waiting for someone else to come along and rescue me because I don't need rescuing. You need a wake up call and you're getting it right now. Okay. So put in the comments, what is it that you want to change? Like for real, what aspect of your life do you need to reinvent yourself? Is that what's on the table here? I mean, when our kids leave this fall, my husband and I, we were like, oh my God, this is a whole new chapter. It's going to be freaking amazing. Do you need to refocus on your business and double down? Is that what you need to do? Do you need to get serious about your health instead of constantly like just pouring the alcohol down your throat every night and blowing off exercise because you don't feel like it? Well, of course you don't. You're hungover. Why would you feel like exercising? It's time to get serious. I see so many of you. I need to reinvent myself. I really want to start that business. I want to get my YouTube channel up and running for real. I want to learn how to market on social media. I want to start that influencer business. I really want to get control of my health. Like this is what I want to do. I want to forget my boss. I want to go and find a job where I feel alive and fulfilled and that I can really pour everything in. I want to fix my finances. Fan freaking tastic. Terrific. So if you're ready to play a big game, like you want to take a different approach to life, I have something I want you to check out, okay? It is called Launch. There's no hard sales. Mel Robbins does not do hard sales because I do not need to. I think it's icky. I'm going to tell you about something I do once a year. You're an adult. You can check this out. You can see the information for yourself. You can decide if this is something that you want to jump into. And if you don't want to jump into it, that's so freaking cool. I hope that this conversation today is going to give you a wake up call and a kick in the rear end that you need so that you push yourself to do it. But once a year, once a year, only once a year, I do a six month long coaching program called launch. Only do it once a year. Registration for this year's class. The class of 2024 is open right now. It closes in one week. I am dead serious about this. This is the coolest thing that I do of everything that I do in my businesses, writing books, doing the podcast, all the social media content, the online courses that we create for the world's most inspiring brands, all the partnerships that we have, all the original productions that we do. The single coolest thing that I do is this six month program called launch. So I want to tell you about it. I want you as an adult to go and follow the information because this is open for registration for one week and one week only. As soon as registration closes on April 25th at 7 p.m., I close the doors and I do not do this again until 2025. And the reason why I only do this six month coaching program once a year is because my team and I pour everything we have into the next six months of holding you accountable, of empowering you, and of inspiring you to wake up every day and take consistent, aligned, confident action on the things that you wanna make happen. And I'm gonna tell you a little bit about the program, but if you know that this is something that you're like, oh, whoa, I could be in a coaching program that Mel Robbins designed. I could be in a coaching program that Mel Robbins leads. I could be in a coaching program with other people around the world who are in the coaching program trying to launch a business or finish writing the book or get their website done or declutter their life or have healthier habits. This is a group of people that all jump into a program to work on a change that is personal or professional that is uh, unique to them. Wait a minute. I want to check that out. If you want to check that out, I want you to go to the information right down here or just go to melrobbins.com launch. All the information is there. I'm going to cover a little bit of it. 
And here's the thing, there is no hard sell. I am so proud of you for even being here with me. Let me tell you a little bit about why this is so unique and why it is the coolest thing that I do. It is organized around you and what you want to make happen. And so the six months is divided into three project sprints. The program starts on Monday, April 29th. That's when we kick it off. That's day one. And we begin by getting clear about what's a project that you want to work on inside the six month coaching program for a 30 day sprint. And so we gear you up and there's a huge curriculum that's amazing. There's a community. It's all on a private course platform, but you get to choose what your project is going to be. Are you going to write the book? Are you going to use this six month container to understand your finances and make a plan to get financially free? Are you going to use this container to launch that website, to launch that YouTube channel, to put yourself first? to develop healthy habits? Are you gonna use this six month container as a way to get the support and the clarity and the coaching and the science-backed curriculum that you need in order to define what reinventing your life looks like for where you are right now? Because you are gonna come into this program called Launch and you get to define what you're gonna work on, which means the results are deeply personal. And the entire curriculum that I teach, which is science-backed, 44 lectures, 10 live streams, and that's just the beginning. Three different projects you get to pick and work on. And then here's what's super cool. We do these project sprints where for 30 days, you and the classmates that you're going to have from around the world that are launching businesses, raising funding, taking their companies public, they are going back to school. These are a bunch of people that are doers, that are making things happen, that aren't just talking. They are showing and proving to themselves and to the world that their goals and dreams matter. And they are using this container like rocket fuel to hold themselves accountable, to get the push that they need every single day, to continue to leverage velocity and momentum in their life so that by the time you're done with the first 30 day sprint, you will not even recognize how much you accomplished. I will have made it a habit in your life to wake up and be clear about something that matters to you and then to take the action that drives it forward. So if there are things on your list that you have been wanting to find the time to do, I want you to check out my six month coaching program launch. It is open for registration right now. Just click the link right now. I will open this up for one week. We already have a, we already have tons and tons of amazing people that have jumped in and they're gonna use this container to do amazing, amazing things. I wanna read a testimonial from one of our graduates last year. Um, this program launch, changed my life. I'm back in school. I'm graduating with my bachelor's, my bachelor's, hold on, let me start again. I'm back in school, graduating with my bachelor's degree in entrepreneurship in a year. I started a new career. I moved. I created a space for me. If you told me a year ago, I'd be where I am today, I'd say you're lying. Thank you, Mel. And thank you, Mel's team for pushing me to restart my life. That is from a graduate of last year's program. And you want to know why the results are so jaw dropping? Because this is a program about action. I am not teaching you like my technique for course funnels. I'm not teaching you how to become a coach in Mel Robbins coaching program. I don't do that. I want to see you win. And I want to see you learn how to wake up every day and put your goals and your dreams in the front of the line when it comes to your energy and your time. How much time does this take? It takes 30 minutes a day. I think you got 30 minutes a day for you 30 minutes a day where you're going to work on yourself 30 minutes a day where you're going to inch forward your dreams 30 minutes a day where you're going to get the accountability and the coaching and the science back hacks and tools and strategies to keep yourself moving and to pick yourself back up all right and i love seeing the comments that you are noticing wow i am uh really been in victim mode lately yeah i've been sitting around thinking not a lot of doing. Well, you don't have time for that, and neither do I. And that's why I created this program. We've had more than 10,000 people over the years graduate from this program. They have used it to launch businesses, to go back to school, to finish the grant paperwork for their nonprofit, 
On the personal side, lots of people reinventing themselves, life after divorce, life after cancer, life after retirement, life after losing a job, being in a terrible job or career you no longer like, but having no idea what you want, using this container to figure out what's your purpose and how do you bring it to life? How do you do that? Well, I'll tell you how you do that. You wake up every day and you work on it. And that's what this program is all about. It's about defining what you want and bringing it to life through the actions that you take every single day. And you will get coaching on mindset. You will get coaching all about habit building. You will get coaching about resilience and how you pick yourself back up. You will get coaching around how you deal with rejection, how you deal with setbacks, how you reframe the obstacles that are in your way that come up as you start moving while you're working on something that matters to you. I love seeing Thunderhead. I am becoming my own hero. That's right. You are the hero of your own life. And you need to answer the call that the hero always gets. You know, there's this part in every movie, if you look at the hero's journey, where the hero is reluctant, Luke Skywalker in the beginning. He's on you know, the planet. He doesn't really think that there's anything else going on. He gets the call in a robot. You know, come on, Luke the Force, Luke, Luke. He doesn't view himself as the person that is going to save the solar system. Just like you don't view yourself as the person that is going to be the hero of your own life. And I am here with a message and a call to the hero inside of you, that it is time for you to awaken the power that you have to change your own life. It is time for you to support yourself. And look, if you check out launch, all the information is there, the dates of the 10 live trainings, the registration information, the refund policy, the payment plans that we offer. This is risk-free because there is a refund window. So you can jump into this container and you can feel it out. And if you don't like it, just do everything that it says in the return policy and request the return. And there you go, it's risk-free. And you know, because you listen to the Mel Robbins podcast and you follow me here on social media that I don't screw around. Like I mean business, this is about action. And what I'm gonna be working on is you're gonna go behind the scenes with me as I am launching my next book, the Let Them Theory book. It's going to be coming out in January of 2025. I just moved the date. You are gonna see the behind the scenes of the entire marketing of a global book campaign. And I'm gonna be using the container of launch in the third project sprint to actually chart all that out and bring you along for the ride. And the other thing that I'm going to be working on is I want to make sure that I am more effective at work because with our son graduating, one of my huge projects is I don't want to miss out on this last summer with him. I don't want to miss out on this spring. I want to squeeze as much time with my family and be present as I possibly can and not be so busy and stressed all the time. That's my goal. You get to choose what you want to work on. And the coolest part is there are three different project sprints, three different project sprints, three different opportunities between now and October for you to pick something that is powerful in your life and get the coaching and the accountability and the structure and the momentum that comes from all these people around you working and doing it and doing their thing and cheering you on. This is all that's been missing. This is all that's been missing for you is imagine how different your life would be if you we're inside of a six month coaching program where you get to work on what you wanna work on, but inside this container that I've built that is designed to launch you forward. You're not gonna recognize yourself in October. Heck, you're not even gonna recognize yourself come the end of May at the end of this first project sprint because you will have been doing something that you're not currently doing, which is waking up every day and you are chipping away at something that matters at you and you're getting the positive reinforcement that only comes from being inside a container like the one that I've built called Launch. So again, I want you to go right in here, check it out, and um, you're an adult. If you can't afford this, don't do it. If it's not a fit for you, don't do this. Um, one thing I wanna point you to is we did launch Make It Happen. I don't know where my workbook is. But for those of you that this is not what you are interested in, Make It Happen is the free two hour training complete with a 29 page workbook that helps you build your own roadmap 
that helps you understand the principles that we are going to put into action inside of the program launch. Um, let me think. What else did I want to say? Uh, I think that's it. I think that's it. Whatever it is that you want to do, you are capable of doing it. You want to finally have your first public art exhibition? You could do that in the next six months. You want to launch that new business? You could do that in the next six months. You want to make a plan and start executing on a plan to focus on the marketing of your side hustles so you can step away from your job that you can't stand? You could do that in the next six months. You want to change your career? You could do that in the next six months. You want to improve your marriage? You could do that. You want to reinvent your life? You could do that. If you can think it up, you can create a plan to make it happen. And if launch is not something that appeals to you, just use the free program I just gave more than 320,000 of you. And you can find that at melrobbins.com slash make it happen. But for those of you that are like, oh my gosh, I have been waiting for Mel Robbins to offer an opportunity to be in a coaching program. I have been waiting to take this work deeper. I have been wanting a container of positive, successful people that are up to something huge. I have been looking for a community that is going to inspire me and also empower me and encourage me and that I can draft off of. This is it right here. And again, it is the single coolest thing that I do because it creates real results in people's lives just like you. So again, check it out. Registration is closing at 7 p.m. April 25th, 7 p.m. Eastern. And the second that 7 p.m. Eastern, April 25th hits, we take registration down and the wait list for launch 2025 goes up. I do not screw around. Why? Because procrastination has already killed so much of your life. And if you continue to allow procrastination and thinking about it and overthinking and worrying and self-doubt to stand in your way, you will never experience the full possibility of the life that you could be living. See, I see something different for you. I see a happier you. I see a successful, even wildly successful you. I see somebody who is full of energy and joy and you feel a sense of agency that you, yeah, you got a busy life, but you've also made it a habit to wake up every day and to put yourself and the things that you really care about and that matter to you first. And you prove it by doing it. And that's what this program's all about. And you know, if it's not for you, I'm still proud of you. I'm still here cheering for you. I have make it happen for you for free for a reason because I know with an audience the size that we have and with the podcast being in 194 countries, not everybody can do this. But if this speaks to you, if this is the right time, the right message, the right program, the right coach at the right time, let's go. Jump in because nobody's coming to save you. No one. And I'm here offering this, but you're the one that's going to do the work. And that's how it needs to be because your life, your dreams, your health, your happiness, it's your responsibility. And it is an honor to be here with you through the podcast and on social media uh, to inspire and empower you in the ways that I can using these formats. And it is the privilege of a lifetime to be able to spend six months with you being your coach. So thank you in advance for checking this out and seeing if this is for you. If it is, 54321, jump in. Let's freaking go. Because the second that you register, the program begins. There are already three videos that are waiting for you. There's a lot of setup homework to do. And again, it is 30 minutes a day. It is a six-month coaching program with me and you and some of the coolest people that you will ever meet. My entire team will be deployed against this program for the next six months, supporting you and your success and your growth and helping you be accountable to the results that you want to see happen in your life. And Remember, no one's coming. No one's coming. And that's good because in every moment of your life where you've been at that crossroads, it was always you. You were the one that made the decision to change. You were the one that made the decision to start turning your life in a new direction. You were the one that defined the goal. You were the one that made it happen. 
And you are the one that's going to make it happen now. So thank you, thank you, thank you for being here with me. In case no one else tells you, I wanted to tell you that I love you. I believe in you. I believe in your ability to create an amazing life. And it would be an honor to welcome you into the amazing class of 2024 that is already registering and assembling from around the world. Your life will not be the same because this entire program is backed by science, created by me and engineered to create results in your life through consistent action. So let's freaking launch. Here we go, everybody.